snow isn't quite as magical in January as it was in December, but it's still pretty. Good morning. Good morning, girls. Did you have a good night? The snow is kind of a constant thing. This year seems like there's more snow than other years. Lately it seems if it's not snowing, it's because it's too cold to snow. So we've had really low temperatures, um, you know, down around zero most of the time. Uh, and then when it warms up to the 20s, then it starts snowing. So it's one or the other. And um, uh, although I like plowing, I've gotten bored with it. Um, so, and I don't know, I guess I'm probably the first to get cabin fever in our family. Uh, I would like to be able to do more things during the winter other than just uh, sort of maintain, but it's, that's what it is. I do like living in the forest and this is just kind of part of it. Well, it's been almost a week since we last vlogged. It's very cold here. It's been in the single digits or even slightly negative numbers as far as temperatures go. and. Um, the, the place where I have to go to post videos is not heated. So for those who are warm weather people, the difference between 25 degrees or even 30 degrees in an unheated space and zero degrees is a really big difference. It's been hard for me to get down to the yurt. But not, it, it was not a week without anything happening. Um, Nick did finish the hat rack. So to get the bend on these little feet, these are eye bolts. I actually had to heat them up with the torch and get them glowing red to get that heat, to get that bend to happen. Um, otherwise it was wanting to bend further up here, but I really want it. It just looks like a nice furniture foot that way. Um, and, uh, and I got that all put together, made three shapes that look like that and used those to um, get this thing standing up as straight as it is anyway. And then I added these bolts to get this uh, surface to uh, the height that I wanted it. So even without making real significant progress on the house during these months when it's so cold and snowy, um, we're still trying to just fill the needs that we do have with stuff that we have. So this definitely falls in that category. Um, it's definitely uh, more of an art piece than a, than a um, fine craft piece, but uh, I'm happy with it. also did a little project um, fixing the gear shift on his four-wheeler. So let's check that out. So I've been limping along with a broken gear shift handle on the four-wheeler during all this snow. I didn't take time to fix it because um, I had to use it instead. So this was my temporary gear shift handle, pretty fancy, a bolt that I bent and then stuck it in this end and moved it around. But then I managed to get this off of the four-wheeler and I have to weld that back on. It just cut through because I shift so much, I guess. Um, I do a lot of back and forth shoving snow off the side of the road. So, but I'll get a, probably a piece of this bolt in there as a plug and do a plug weld through a hole on both sides and then actually weld up the seam and grind it smooth and then we'll be back in action.
So I got it all welded back together, uh, pretty much in its original shape, and got it installed. I managed to uh, get the the rubber grip bolted back on, um, which actually had been sliding off for almost the entire time I've had this thing. Um, and I managed to not drop the tiny little cotter pin that holds the whole thing together. So this is in a much better situation than what it was. And um, by putting that a piece of steel on the inside of this tube, because this is actually tube, um, by putting a piece of steel on the inside of that, even if this wears, because that's what cut it in half, is just wearing against this against this steel plate, even if that that wears into it, it's not going to cut it open again. Uh, it'll have it has a solid piece of steel on the inside of it now, uh, and I think I got it done just in time because we got a bunch of new snow today, so we'll put it to the test. There's snow falling again, but none of the kids are out in it. None at all. Because it's too cold. Because snow isn't as cool in January as it is in December. While I'm inside and I'm not going outside because it's too cold, I've been reading these. The cover of this one looked cool when Milo got it for me for Christmas. And and I started, so I started reading it, but it just kept getting cooler, so I decided to really finish it. And now I want to see what happens next. I love to see a kid happy in books. The land of stories. That's what Stella is into right now. Someone gave us a gift of maple sugar. So we're making our special dessert tonight with maple sugar. Whoa! Whoa! That's a lot of sugar. Wait, are these eggnog cups? Yes. It's heavy and cold.